Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video on Harun Quotes. I am Harun NG, I am a Nigerian and I am here to help you fix the issue of the request install package permission. How to remove that permission from your apps on Play Store so as for your app to get approved without any hurdles. So um, before we go for that, what you can only do is for you to click on the like button and also subscribe to this channel to stay tuned for more awesome videos. This thing happened to me last three days, which is last week. Uh, since today is Monday, you know, I fixed the issue the day before yesterday and my app got approved once again on Play Store because it was rejected. I have an app there already and I just went there to change my app, this is my app website, this is my app URL. And once I changed the app URL for the app to be updated, I got an email that my app is not compliant and it has been rejected or the update was rejected that I should make my app to be compliant. And I saw the reasons for the, you know, for the app not being compliant, it was that you know, they say my app has something like request install package permission that needs to be removed. And I must remove that very permission. It's needed to be removed immediately. So I said, okay, what type of permission is this? Because I build my own apps on no code platforms. So I said, okay, how can I do this? I cannot have access to my code base. I went to YouTube, I went online, I did a lot of research, nothing. If you go to YouTube now, you don't even find any video that is speaking specifically about this stuff in this English language. So this is the first video about how you can remove the stuff. So that if you are using code, to build your application, I'm going to give you an answer. And if you're using no code, I'm going to give you an answer as well. What I just want is for this video to reach 100 likes. And yeah, thank you very much for that. What you need to do as a coder, if you are building applications with coding, just go to your code base and then you have to remove the request install package permission from your code base and review the app bundle and publish it to Play Store. Yeah, republish it as an update to Play Store. That's what you need to do. And if your own code does not have anything like that that has to do with request install package permission. If you don't have anything like that, then calm down. I'm going to answer a question based on how I'm going to answer a no coder question. So if you're using no code or your code base also have the request install package permission, what you need to do if you're using no code, like if you're using mobile to build your apps, if you have this issue of request install package permission that you need to remove from your app, just go and review your app bundle. Go to your uh, app view page, review the app bundle, and publish republish the app bundle as an update to your old app on Play Store. I bet it's going to be removed because three days ago I fixed my own and that was how I just went there to change my app URL and they just sent me a message that okay, my, my update was rejected because my app has this so, so, so error. So once I rebuild the app update, I send it to them and yeah, it got approved. So for you guys who are looking for an answer, this is the answer to the you know to the issue on Play Store. Um, yeah, I'm Harun Senji from Harun Codes. Thank you very much for watching and I will catch you guys in the very next video. Peace.